Next steps again, I guess. Yeah. Uh, actually, if you cut down, right, right, uh, basically, yeah, exactly. Just cut down. You'll hit some magnetite as you go down. Yeah. Yeah. I'm using my wood power cell, switching where I can. Oh, I see. Okay, that's bedrock. Okay. I think we progressed too fast, so. Is this? That's magnetite, okay. Too fast. <laughs> yeah. I don't think so. I think this is the right amount. Yeah. There's a lot of magnetite here, actually. Careful. That's the, the block there. just just dis disappeared. Yeah, because there was magnetite there, yeah. Oh. Oh, you grabbed it? Yeah. Alright, so let's go over this way, I guess. Oh, shit. I shouldn't have done that. What? You fell? No, no, but there's this... the other chamber here. Yeah, oh. oh. We're being attacked. Oh. oh. Back up, back up. One more. Uh -huh. <laughs> Over here. Ah, oh, this place. Oh, mirror's coming, mirror's coming. Oh, shit. Oh, oh blind. Oh, he does like a blinding attack, eh? There you go. But that's fine, you can still hit him, though. <laughs> yeah. Uh. So when he like like crossbows or pistols or something, you know, those so mirrors aren't too bad actually. No, not that, not that, not that we have the obsidian swords. Yeah. Well, that makes a big difference, right? There's all this stuff here. Fuck it. Hey, Win Fox, how's it going? Thanks for uh, joining. <laughs> yeah, I think this game is definitely worth uh, getting into early access. Yeah, yeah, it's one of the few that would be really worth it, yeah. And I'm going to guess if you get into early access, you'll probably get some uh, bonuses. Right? With this one, yeah. When, when the game goes free to play. Okay, that's all, that's all the rock ones I need. <laughs> Remy put in 50 hours and he's still not bored. Nice. Nice. Taking this magnetite. Yeah, I've got a lot of that now. Whoa! 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 Oh shit! Whoa! Blind! Ah, where are you? Oh, he's dead. Holy crap! He's dead. Okay. Yeah, just keep attacking when he blinds you. <laughs> do what he needs to do. He needs to blind you and then run away. Right. <laughs> can't do that. Oh, there's siltstone here. That's new. Oh, oh. oh, you got two guys on you now. That's not good. Oh, oh it's the fucker still stunned me. Or not stunned yeah. me, but. Yeah. There we go. He's on you. There we go. 
Look at that rock thing. See, this this guy just spawned in the dark there. Yeah. yeah. Well, we gotta put more torches. There's Another the guy just spawned there. too. Yeah. Must be daytime. There, that one's dead. Whoa! There, Miru. Where are you, Miru? Whoa. Oh, he's got blind. Well, one of the biggest differences between this game and Minecraft is that the monsters are way better. All have like special attacks you have to look for, and you have to kind of run around and just sit there and attack. You gotta avoid their attacks. Um, the recipes are in the game, but you have to kind of craft through your tiers to unlock recipes. So you can't go straight, you know, from wood picks to iron picks, say, right? You have to go through your tiers. And then instead of mi for mining, you use uh, the mining cell technology. So you have a little glove here that allows you to mine stuff like that. Whoa, hold on. Okay, good. Oops. And uh, yeah, so by using the power glove to mine, these are like constantly spawning here. I'm trying to place torches down, but yeah. you need yes. uh, you need higher level mining cells to get higher level blocks. So, and then there's teleporters in the game, so you can teleport, right? Yeah, we got one set base. up already. Yeah. yeah. So it, 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 it's a lot more technology based as well. Wow, there's more obsidian here. Oh, what's this up here? Is that magnetite? Yeah, magnetite. Oh, another one. Yeah, they're spawning on that side. So I'm gonna try and put a stop to it. And as you can see, you don't have hunger or thirst or anything like that. You just have healing potions you make. Yeah. Another big difference. It's definitely a different experience, that's for sure. And then you have different tier. Oh, wow, my <coughs> chest piece is, is destroyed. <laughs> definitely have to go back and make it a new one. I'll look up top there, straight up. Straight up? Yeah. There should be a creature up top there. Yeah, that's <laughs> fine. Fine, he can stay up there. Okay, there we go. And then to actually mine certain nodes, uh, like this one here, this is obsidian node. You can't harvest that like you would with your power glove, right? To get that, you have to make extractors, and the extractors will slowly harvest uh, this stone out of there. So that's yeah. another big difference, right? You actually use extractors to get your metal nodes or your 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 main crafting nodes. So yeah, it's it's definitely a lot different. You know, which way did we come from? Was it over here? Oh, there we go. It just uh, it dinged me. We actually we can get to. Oh, we can actually cut into here. And we can get to the teleporter quicker. There's a safe way down. Oh, I have to pick up the one extractor. Yeah, exactly. You put the extractor down on your nodes and keep exploring. You just have to remember where you put them. <laughs> yeah. I think they show up, though. Yeah. So I'm here's a teleporter that you can make, right? So, you, so as you explore, you can place a teleporter down, and then, boom, you're in your, your whole base. You can craft whatever you need to craft, and boom, you go back, right? Yeah. So you can just keep exploring. You, you don't have to worry about you know, making your way through the caves and going all the way back to your home base and or making multiple bases or whatever. So yeah, I kind of like that. But like I said, I need to make some extractors. Um, oh, you, oh, you just walk on it and it takes you. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. That's cool. And, then, and what we got here is, this is the forge we use to cook stuff. And cooking is a little different too. You just put it in, right? And it cooks one, one ore. So you'd have to... Put a bunch? 
put a bunch in there, cook, press cook a bunch of times. You can't just put it in there and, you know, and you don't need fuel to cook, you don't need to burn wood or whatever to cook. No. Exactly. Uh, I wouldn't say you have to pay the end game stuff now because you're paying into the alpha. Maybe when the game goes free to play, that might be how it is. But that's what you would expect from a free to play game. Is that you know you have to pay for it at some point, and I'm hoping that the people who paid for the alpha will probably get an unlocked version when it goes free to play, so that won't be an issue. Yeah. So to buy it right now on Steam for ten bucks, I'd say the game is totally worth that. Yeah, yeah. Because it's in early it's in early access right now, right? For so, the price that it is, yeah. yeah. I think we can start thinking about building a base, because... <laughs> yeah, I think so. This little place isn't, isn't doing it anymore. No, well, it gives me an idea of how big to build, right, as well. Yeah, so. yeah exactly, yeah. So, and here's all the different uh, crafting recipes that you get as you explore. So when you when you first start, you only get, like, one roll yeah, you, of one... It's very, thing. very limited, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and as you craft, oh, I actually found... Oh, a stamina regen potion, nice. Oh, that's what crystal shards are for. Uh, stamina regens, and then there's a health regen potion too, and crystal shards okay. for that. Oh, use mold for that too, so don't process your mold. Uh oh. Because you need that for health regen potions. Shit. So basically, you don't want to process too much of it then. Crap. Yeah. Yeah, the game is very polished in the animations and the graphical look of it. And yeah, yeah, surprisingly, it's a, yeah. It's a very nice looking game, for sure. Compared to other games, you know, where people don't put as much effort into that. And then you have different life sources here, and as, as you make them different life sources, they get brighter and brighter, right? So, yeah, it's kind of... Oh, we have, yeah, we have the iron mine cell, but we don't have iron yet, so that's going to be a while. But, you know, we start with just the wood sword, and as I uh, made the wood sword, it allowed me to make the stone sword, and when I made the stone sword, it then unlock the obsidian sword, so you have to make each tier, basically. And that's okay, because the weapons and that armor degrade anyway, so even if you make a lower tier item, you can, it'll wear off and you, know, you can use the higher tier stuff or whatever, yeah, so. Yeah, exactly. So I kind of like that. Oh, I'm like, see him, see him, see him going where? up the hill there? Where? Top the hill there. Oh, way up there, okay. Looks like he's, he's stuck. I'll get to him now. Whoa! Shit! Okay, we're gonna have to do something about that fucking hole. Where is he? Where is he? It's gonna fucking kill me one of these days. How'd she even get up there? Jeez. Oh, whew! Got him. Oh, you got him? Oh. Yeah. Had three uh, arc things. Holy fuck! How did I oh, get up there? What's this? That's the There's top. There's a hole right here. Is there? Yeah. <laughs> In our house. It's the top of our house there. Yeah. <laughs> do I have my harvesters? Yeah, I do. Okay, cool. Okay. Back to what I was doing. I need to craft something actually. Oh, geez, there's a whole bunch up here. A whole bunch of what? Oh. The special guys? No, coal nodes. Stone floor, that's right. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Oh, I need to craft the door too. Okay. One piece works. That's actually funny. How oh, there's like coal just like right there, and we could have had right away. <laughs> oh, yeah, wow, well, that's ironic. Yeah. Oh, so it's on a chair. Actually, what I'm gonna do now, now that you've got that. I'll build up.